The Invincible is near. We can wait for its arrival. <laughs> right. That is one solution. Somehow I had a feeling I would never leave this place. You don't have a lander? We have two. But the cloud destroyed both. Huh. Done. More heads are armed. One more press of a button. There'll be no turning back. I can't. Uh, that was close. I'm suspending all actions leading to conflict. What should I do now? We no longer have any landers. So I hate to say it, but I can't help you. And believe me, I would like nothing better. Let's send a message to the Invincible. A short report on the status of the crew. And on our... discoveries. You should also introduce yourself as a member of the Commonwealth. It's better not to hide it, as it will only arouse suspicion. Don't worry about that, Novik. It's up to me to make sure they understand everything. Now, let me check on the guys. I want to make sure they're stable. I hope we'll speak again, Astrogator. Well, until then, Rahitra. I'll join you soon. No hurry, Asna. Take your time. So... He's gone. Doctor... Yes, no. It was truly an honor. <sighs> I'm having a hard time finding the right words. I know I couldn't keep my mouth shut. Sometimes. But that doesn't change the fact that I'm extremely grateful to you. You could have flown away so many times, yet you stayed with me until the end. Thank you. You shouldn't thank me. It was my bounden duty as commander. My only regret is that I couldn't do more. And that some decisions... Please don't blame yourself anymore. There's no point. Now Koval and Krauter need you. Understood? Yes, Mom. Have a safe journey, Novik. Thank you, yes, sir. And... See you soon. Over and out. Are you sure? Yeah. You look... Uh -huh. Like shit. I know. Uh, really tired. That's what I meant to say. Because you're trying to be polite. The undeniable truth is... I look and feel like shit. <sighs> Will you close it for me? Uh, of course. Uh, support and stimulants will help you. I won't sleep. I can't. You know that. I admit I would do the same in your place, thinking about losing yourself. Your memories it scares me, but that doesn't mean I should help you hurt yourself. Primum non nature. You're not hurting me, Asta. You will actually make sure to hurt myself, like the dumbass I am. It's a strange feeling. Remaining conscious in the hibernator. <laughs> you clearly haven't visited the infirmary often. This is a standard procedure for a long recovery. Will you take another look at Landor and Spluskas? I'm doing it now. Don't worry. Thanks. Are you still wondering whether to go to the nest? This is probably your last chance. If you want to make it before the Invincible arrives, it would be good to have you here. When they come, the journey there and back will take you about 12 hours. I've been thinking about it for a while, and it's something I just have to do. 
I might be the only person who can make contact to to understand. I know. But you will come back, won't you? I intend to. Actually, I don't. I think we should proceed with the attack. Even after everything you've learned, Doctor? After everything you've been through? Because of it, we have to destroy the cloud. Well, I still have significant concerns. But you're the other one there, not me. Maybe I'm not seeing the whole picture. Well, indeed, Novik. I knew Yasna would understand. Now give me a minute. I'm almost done. See these switches? The ones on the launch control unit? Yeah, I see. Do I use them to launch the rockets? Not yet. We use a button for that. The red one. waiting for yes sir. just one push and the cloud will get what it deserves watch your eyes They're flying this way. What have you done? Astrocator, you must evacuate. Now. I'll join you later.
this is gonna work, the attack must be all out. What are you saying, Doctor? After a sufficiently powerful explosion, the ocean waters will begin to vaporize. Cloud cover will increase. The albedo will rise. And the resident symbionts won't be able to provide the minimum energy needed for reproduction. So yes, we can destroy the cloud. Ha! I knew it! Along with ourselves. Oh. You don't think we can defeat them and survive? Technically, we'd have to wipe out the entire planet. That's not our goal here, is it? No, it's not. So, you think there's no point trying with smaller charges? We would risk our lives for nothing. So yeah, I am against bombing. We won't help anyone this way. Uh, but what else could we do if not attack? We can leave this place and never come back. How so? The commander will swoop down from orbit and pick us up? Or do you have an extra ship up your sleeve? I'm afraid none of these. I was thinking about the saucer. Or some other vehicle from the condor. Don't count on it, Yasna. It's a miracle we arrived on that wreck of a saucer. Nothing else flies around here, I checked. Let's drop it, all right? Further discussion is pointless. The charges are almost ready. Rehitra, for fuck's sake, be reasonable! You won't stand down, will you? An escalatory solution won't work. We'll only needlessly draw the cloud's attention. And I won't have you endanger my subordinate. Oh, good one. I wasn't the one who sent her to the service. Rehitra? Rehitra, oh, uh. He won't answer you, sir. Not anymore. Oh. Did you neutralize him? I put him to sleep. It's cruel, I know. He will forget everything. All over again. No, yes, no, you did the right thing. He wasn't listening to reason. Oh, he would have blown everything up. Most likely along with the both of you. They actually saved his life. <sighs> I'd love to fly away. Go back home. Uh, sorry, Esther. If only I could switch places with you. I wouldn't let you do that, sir. <laughs> of course. Gotten to know you quite well recently. And you certainly wouldn't. So, all we can do now is... Yes, indeed, Doctor. Y yes, sir. It was truly an honor. <sighs> I'm having a hard time finding the right words. I know I couldn't keep my mouth shut. Sometimes. But that doesn't change the fact that I'm extremely grateful to you. You could have flown away so many times, yet you stayed with me until the end. Thank you. You shouldn't thank me. It was my bounden duty as commander. My only regret is that I couldn't do more. And that some decisions... Please don't blame yourself anymore. There's no point. Now Kovel and Krauter need you. Understood? Yes, Mom. Have a safe journey, Novik. Thank you, yes, sir. And... See you soon. Over and out. Finally. It's them. They're switching through the channels. Searching for me. Slow it down a little. Mm, all right. Seems no one's answering here. Yeah? I'll try another channel. To all units in the perimeter, this is the chief navigator of the USCA Invincible Cruiser. Hello, Invincible. It's Condor here. Oh, Condor, we hear you, I confirm. We picked up your coordinates yesterday with a message from a member of the Interplanetary Commonwealth. Invincible, I confirm. 
This is Dr. Yasna, the IC member. Dr. Yasna, nice to meet you. My name is Rohan. Is it your message that we received? I yes. In that case, I'd like a confirmation. Are the rest of the crew still unconscious? Hey, you. I confirm. You. What have you done? The Invincible is near. We can wait for its arrival. Huh, right. That is one solution. Although I was hoping you'd come back to Dragonfly. Back home. Huh. Done. Warheads are armed. One more press of a button. And there'll be no turning back. I can't. Uh, that was close. I'm suspending all actions leading to conflict. But what should I do now? We have a lander. So you can get to the Dragonfly. All of us? I'm staying. What? What? I'm staying here. We'll wait for the Invincible together. Yes, sir. Are you sure? Someone has to warn them, Astrogator. And Rahitra is... well... Don't sugarcoat it, Yasna. I think we're all aware of my condition. Yes, the doctor reported it. Because of this and many other reasons, I feel I must stay. Uh, well, I need to check on the guys. It was good talking, Astrogator. See you in a minute, Yasna. Yeah, take care. So, he's gone. Doctor. Yes, no. It was truly an honor. I'm having a hard time finding the right words. I hate moments like this, where nothing can be done, fixed, changed. All you can do is say goodbye. <laughs> it's right. I feel the same way. Have a safe journey, Novik. Copy that. And thank you for your service, Yasna. Over and out. That's what I meant to say. Because you're trying to be polite. The undeniable truth is, I look and feel like shit. <sighs> Will you close it for me? Of course. Support and stimulants will help you. I won't sleep. I can't. You know that. I have to endure somehow. It, it won't get to that. Because I'll tell you everything all over again. No, yes, no. I know me all too well. I won't believe the cloud can't be defeated. Or help you convince the Invincibles crew you're innocent. You'll end up in custody, and they'll just repeat our mistakes. That's a strange feeling. Remaining conscious in the hibernator. <laughs> you clearly haven't visited the infirmary often. This is a standard procedure for a long recovery. Will you take another look at Landor and Spluskas? I'm doing it now. Don't worry. Thanks. Are you still wondering whether to go to the nest? This is probably your last chance. If you want to make it before the Invincible arrives, it would be good to have you here. When they come, the journey there and back 
will take you about 12 hours. No, I'm not going. I know it's a unique opportunity to get closer to this phenomenon, and I might never get another chance. But I've thought about it a lot, and I'd rather stay here with you. Now rest. You should save your strength for their arrival. We can leave this place and never come back. We have a lander. Sorry, but I'm not going anywhere. You on the other hand? I'm surprised you didn't evacuate already. Well, I had to make sure you won't do something you'll deeply regret. Huh. I'm done. More heads are armed. One more press of a button. There'll be no turning back. I can't. Uh, that was close. I'm suspending all actions leading to conflict. But what should I do now? Well, we have a lander. So you can get to the Dragonfly. All of us? Yes. Your men are welcome on board. I'm going back. And you, Rahitra? Are you flying with us? You actually mean it? Damn. Thank you, but I can't leave just before my people arrive. I have to tell them about the cloud, necro-evolution, this whole mess. But, but you... I can handle it, Yasna. I'll take the stimulants and hold out until they arrive. Whatever it takes to stay awake. Maybe I can write it all down. Wouldn't it be better if you took my diary? It contains everything I've learned. Huh. As long as your commander doesn't mind. Please take it, Comrade Rehitra. There are no more factions on this forsaken planet. We're all just people here. Thank you, for this and for everything else. I've prepared Hopper for departure, but there's still a matter of access to the landing pad on the back. Novik, how do you know about our landing pad? Well, you know what they say? Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Astrogator likes big ships. <laughs> right. Anyway... Someone has to break the force field and open the dome. The field automatically deactivates when the dome is opened. It's the same switch on the control station. All right. Sounds simple enough. <sighs> okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Hopper is on its way. Good luck, Rahitra. Thanks. I'm gonna need it. Have a safe flight, Yasna. The Commonwealth ain't all that bad. Yes. 
we've reconnected. Great. Hopper is just landing. Wow, already? It went smoothly. The landing pad is generous in proportion. <sighs> like everything here. I can see Hopper. I can't believe I'm finally coming back to you. I'm very happy to hear it, Gasna. Me too, it's just... It was such a long and difficult mission. Are you ready? I'll just close the hatch and... And what? Never mind. I'm gonna strap myself in now. Ready. Copy that. Hopper is taking off in three, two, one. Spending all actions leading to conflict. But what should I do now? We have a lander. So you can get to the Dragonfly. All of us? I'm going back. And you, Rahitra? Are you flying with us? You actually mean it? Damn. Thank you. But I can't leave just before my people arrive. I have to tell them about the cloud, necro evolution, this whole mess. But you. I can handle it, Yasna. I'll take the stimulants and hold out until they arrive. Whatever it takes to stay awake. Maybe I can write it all down. Good idea. Making records help me keep my head in all this madness. Hmm. That's comforting, I guess. I've prepared Hopper for departure, but there's still a matter of access to the landing pad on the back. Novik, how do you know about our landing pad? Well, you know what they say? Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Astrogator likes big ships. <laughs> right. Anyway, someone has to break the force field and open the dome. The field automatically deactivates when the dome is opened. It's the same switch on the control station. All right. Sounds simple enough. Okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Hopper is on its way. Good luck, Rahitra. Thanks. I'm gonna need it. Have a safe flight, Yasna. You Commonwealth ain't all that bad. Connected. Great. Hopper is just landing. Wow, already? It went smoothly. The landing pad is generous in proportion. <sighs> like everything here. Too. It's just... It was such a long and difficult mission.
Are you ready? I'll just close the hatch and... And what? It's nothing. I'm gonna buckle up now. Ready. Copy that. Hopper is taking off in three, two, one. We can leave this place and never come back. We have a lander. Sorry, but I'm not going anywhere. You on the other hand? I'm surprised you didn't evacuate already. Well, I had to make sure you won't do something you'll deeply regret. Let's drop it, all right? Further discussion is pointless. The charges are almost ready. Rahit, for the fuck's sake, be reasonable. You won't stand down, will you? An escalatory solution won't work. It will only needlessly draw the crowd's attention. Stop arguing. But Doctor... No, Astrogator. You can't always get your way. And you, Rahitra, blow up this cloud yourself and the entire planet if you want. Just let me fly away first. Can you at least do that for me? Yes, I'll wait. I've prepared Hopper for departure, but there's still a matter of access to the landing pad on the back. How do you know about our landing pad? Well, you know what they say? Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Astrogator likes big ships. <laughs> right. Anyway, someone has to break the force field and open the dome. The field automatically deactivates when the dome is open. It's the same switch on the control station. All right. Sounds simple enough. Okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Hopper is on its way. Good luck, Rahitra. Thanks. Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Yes. We've reconnected. Great. Hopper is just landing. Okay. I can still make it in time. Do you think Rahitra will start firing without warning, do you? I don't know. And I don't want to find out. Are you ready? I'll just close the hatch and... And what? Never mind. I'm gonna strap myself in now. Ready. I made it. Copy that. I'm starting the engines. Three, two, one. Oh no. We're hit just started the attack. Shit. Radiation's rising back. EM field two, we might get cut off. I repeat, we might get cut off. We can leave this place and never come back. We have a lander. Sorry, but I'm not going anywhere. You on the other hand? I'm surprised you didn't evacuate already. Well, I had to make sure you won't do something you'll deeply regret. Let's drop it, all right? Further discussion is pointless. The charges are almost ready. Rahit, for fuck's sake, be reasonable. You won't stand down, will you? 
An escalatory solution won't work. I'll only needlessly draw the clouds' attention. And I won't have you endanger my support. Oh, good one. I wasn't... Rehitra? Rehitra, over. She won't answer you, sir. Not anymore. Oh. Did you neutralize him? I put him to sleep. It's cruel, I know. He will forget everything. All over again. No, yes, no, you did the right thing. He wasn't listening to reason. I'd have blown everything up. Most likely along with the both of you. It doesn't matter anymore. I want to leave as soon as possible, Astrogator. Leave the Alliance, the Flies, this planet. Leave it all behind. I'm already preparing the ladder. One more thing. As far as I know, there's a landing pad on the bow of the Condor. You must open it somehow, so that I have a place to land for her. Copy that. I'll look for a way to access it. Okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Hopper is on its way. It's hard to believe I'm finally gonna leave this place. Connected. Great. Hopper is just landing. I can see Hopper. I can't believe I'm finally coming back to you. I'm very happy to hear it, Yasna. Me too. It's just... It was such a long and difficult mission. Are you ready? I'll just close the hatch and... Strap myself in now. Ready. Copy that. Hopper is taking off in three, two, one. Yes, do you agree? Well? Actually, I don't. I think we should proceed with the attack. Even after everything you've done, Doctor? After everything you've been through? Because of it, we have to destroy the cloud. I still have significant concerns. But you're the one there, not me. Maybe I'm not seeing the whole picture. Well, indeed, Novak. I knew Yasna would understand. Now give me a minute. I'm almost done. See these switches? The ones on the launch control unit? Yeah, I see. Do I use them to launch the rockets? Not yet. We use a button for that. The red one. your eyes.
surpassed by our efforts. What? Is this a joke? No one and nothing can... It's unbelievable. They're really just invincible. Another fiasco? This is not happening. It can't be real. They... We're hitched and they're flying this way. We have to flee. But where to? Into orbit. Do you have a landing pad in there? At the bow. All you gotta do is open the dome. Okay, go get the others. I'll take care of this. Okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Hopper is on its way. Head upstairs, Doctor. What about the others? You'll wait for them in the lander. I hope they make it in time. Yes, Nas. Can you hear me? Yes. We've reconnected. Great. Hopper is just landing. Uh, just a few more steps. Jasna, you have to... No. I know what you're gonna say. Just one more minute. Made it. Copy that. I'm starting the engines. Three, two, one. Actually, I don't. I think we should proceed with the attack. Even after everything you've learned, Doctor? After everything you've been through? Because of it, we have to destroy the cloud. I still have significant concerns. If you're the one there, not me. Maybe I'm not seeing the whole pit. Well, indeed, Novik. I knew Yasna would understand. Now give me a minute. I'm almost done. See these switches? The ones on the launch control unit? Yeah, I see. Do I use them to launch the rockets? Not yet. We use a button for that. The red one. Well, what are you waiting for? Yes! Just one push. And the cloud will get what it deserves. Watch your eyes.
think they were impressed by our efforts. What? Is this a joke? No one and nothing can... It's unbelievable. They're really just invincible. Another fiasco? This is not happening. It can't be real. Hey. We're hitching. They're flying this way. We have to flee. But where to? Into orbit. Do you have a landing pad in there? At the bow. All you gotta do is open the dome. Okay, go get the others. I'll take care of this. Okay, got it. Everything's ready, Astrogator. Copy that. Popper is on its way. Had it spared, Doctor. What about the others? You'll wait for them in the land. I hope they make it in time. Connected. Great. Hopper is just landing. Uh, just a few more steps. <sighs> Jasper, you have to. No. I know what you're going to say. Just one more minute. much agree. Another attack would make no difference. Just a few flies are enough for the cloud to regenerate. What if we destroy their nests? No, Ritra. Unless we want to destroy the entire planet, it's impossible to eliminate them all. And even then, there's no guarantee they would die in space. After all, the flies need nowhere, water or food, only solar energy. Uh, but what else could we do if not attack? We can leave this place and never come back. How so? Your commander will swoop down from orbit and pick us up? Or do you have an extra ship up your sleeve? I'm afraid none of these. I was thinking about a saucer or some other vehicle from the Condor. Don't count on it, Yasna. It's a miracle we arrived on that wreck of a saucer. Nothing else flies around here, I checked. Let's drop it, all right? Further discussion is pointless. The charges are almost ready. We're here to the fuck's sake be reasonable. You won't stand down, will you? An escalatory solution won't work. It will only needlessly draw the cloud's attention. Stop. But, Doctor. No, Astrogator. I've had enough of this argument. You can't always get your way. Do what you think is right, Rahitra. How long will it take you? Just a moment. They will pay for all this. They? It's not a conscious entity. It's dead. You're wrong, Yasta. It's about to be dead.
Watch your eyes. sure anything changed. What? Is this a joke? No one and nothing can... It's unbelievable. They really are invincible. Another fiasco? This can't be happening. Doctor, I don't understand. The flies! Rehitra, they're flying this way. What the hell has he done? As for Peter, you must evacuate. Now! I'll... I'll join you later. <laughs> Don't go bright, son. Yes, sir. Don't yes, sir, are you there? My legs are heavy. I feel there's more. 